Good morning. You're listening to FloorDaily.net, and I'm Kemp Harp. This morning, my guest is Dave Chambers, the Director of Flooring with Nebraska Furniture Mart. Dave, how you doing? Doing pretty good. Kemp, how are you today? I'm good. Let's catch up our listeners a little bit about Nebraska Furniture Mart. You're basically in four markets. Obviously, your headquarters in Omaha. You've got a big store in Kansas City and Dallas and one in Des Moines. And you're going to open one in Austin in a year or so, right? Yeah, that's accurate. We're moving some things around in, in Cedar Park, a suburb of Austin there, right? Okay. When is that grand opening supposed to be? Right now, it's tentatively set for uh, spring of 2027. Okay. All right. Still a ways off. Got it. You're on our top 100 list. Of course, this is our estimate, but we've got you as number 21 with around $190 million in annual sales, and that's in flooring. Most people know you've got um, these massive stores there owned by Berkshire Hathaway, and you sell appliances, flooring, and furniture. That's kind of your sweet spot, right? And also electronics. Those are kind of our our four product family pillars. And then there's a lot of adjacent categories that fit into some of those, but those are the main ones. Yeah, I wish there was one. You know, I'm down in Florida right now. I wish there was one in Florida. They're, They're beautiful stores and a place to go for those four categories. So how's business right now? You know, it's soft, Kemp. There's there's no denying it. But I think we, everybody would wish traffic would be a little bit stronger. August is, is always a challenging month with back to school and people finishing up some vacations and things like that. It's off a little bit, but we're out there fighting every day for the sales that are in our markets. So we're coming into Labor Day weekend. It's the primary reason I wanted to talk to you because this is a big sale event. I mean, people who are considering buying flooring, this is a perfect time to buy it. It's a good time to run a sale because you you go ahead and commit now, you get it installed in the next month or so, and you're ready to go before the holidays yet, right? Yeah, I totally agree with you. And that's that's been our philosophy for a number of years. There's that general philosophy, you know, when the holidays get close and the, the Christmas tree goes up, not a lot of flooring goes down, right? So you, you, right. you've got some last big opportunities to really hit the market. And I think a lot of consumers are really looking for the holiday weekends as a great time to see what sales are going on. And we fully capitalize on that and and, uh, try to bring the offers that uh, we think will be enticing enough to get the consumers in the door. I knew we were going to talk this morning. I looked at your website and the big splash on the website when it comes up is up to 55% off. So, I mean, you're bringing in the traffic by saying we're going to discount some things, right? Yeah, I mean, we approach holiday weekends and we try to make them the most enticing offers we can. There's a lot of different vendors that like to partner with us and come up with very unique promotions. I think the main thing right now is like, so you, you've got to convince somebody to come to your store, you know, specifically if they're in the flooring market. That share of people is much smaller today with the struggles in the economy and things we've got going on. And so what are you doing to make it that much more enticing for them to come into your showroom. You're obviously offering some discounted items. Are there specific items that you're discounting? We're doing more broad promotions right now. We think that actually resonates a little bit better on the holiday weekends than maybe a specific product here and a specific product there. Labor Day weekend is the top five weekend for us as a company when it comes to just sheer volume of traffic and written business. We're anticipating a good weekend and we feel like we've got some strong offers out there to get them in the door. One of the things we're looking at as we look at the national flooring sales picture, as you say, it's tough, especially for the middle of the market and the upper market's doing okay. So uh, do you anticipate Mm -hmm. some sales on the veteran goods? Yeah, and we've been seeing that. The veteran goods have continued to sell pretty decent all year long. So what we're hoping to get is the the middle of the market, like you were just talking about. We're trying to get those people more encouraged to buy and not wait any longer. And I think we do that with the promotions that we run on the holiday weekend. And I think at least for the the markets that we're in, we've educated our consumers enough that they know that if there's a holiday weekend coming up, that's typically one of the best times to shop at our store, just from a promotion standpoint and what we've got to offer. Last time I was at your way in Omaha, you were changing out your carpet area and turning it into an ANSO feature area. How's that doing for you? It's been great. You know, we saw an immediate lift in our carpet business when we did that. Of course, the Shaw ANSO product saw a nice lift as well. But just the overall experience has been a little bit different for the consumers. They were used to seeing the same type of flooring displays and carpet displays out there. It's been a wonderful 
addition to our Omaha floor, and we are looking to add that to our Kansas City showroom as well now. Okay. What's your mix now, hard to solve? You know, it depends on region, Kemp, to be truthfully honest, but if we were to look holistically right now, it would still probably 55% carpet, 45% hard surface. You got to understand, like in the Midwest, we still do a lot more carpet than we do hard surface, but down in Dallas, it's definitely the inverse of that. We're going to see you in Washington. It's going to be good to get everybody together with the NFA in Washington in a couple of months, right? Absolutely. It's going to be a good meeting. We've got a lot of great topics on the, the member meeting side, and I know the vendors are excited to get in front of everybody and talk some solutions and ideas that they've got. So it's it's going to be a good all-around meeting for us. All right, Jay. Well, I appreciate you spending time with our listeners. Give me been talking to Dave Chambers, the Director of Flooring in Nebraska Furniture Mart, and you've been listening to Kempar and Floridale.net.